everybody, and welcome back to Smart Intermediate. I hope you guys all had wonderful breaks. I hope that you got to spend lots of time with your friends and your family, the people you care about. I hope it was restful, uh, relaxing, and I don't know about you guys, but one of my favorite parts of the time of the year is eating all the good food. So hopefully you guys got to share some good food together as well. Um, really, we're here finishing up the, the end of the first semester. Uh, by the time you guys hear this, there will be one day left in semester number one. Um, so make sure you guys have a, your assignments in. Um, be getting to work on that, getting those things in. There are no I's this time around. So you gotta get all those assignments in so you get the grades you want and grades are gonna make mom and dad happy. Um, and make sure you're here on time uh, for those assessments. It may sound like a broken record with you guys in attendance and being here on time, uh, but you got to be in those classes. Nothing sets yourself up for success better than being in class with your materials on time to start those um, tests and assessments uh, to, to really do your best. So that's really important. Um, and finally, when we come to the end of a semester, one thing that's always nice to think about is what are your goals for the next semester? Um, what are your goals when it comes to grades? A lot of times we focus on that. Did you get the grades you want? Could you do better? Um, even if you did get good grades, could you do even better than that? Um, we can also think about goals in terms of behavior. Um, how were you behaving this year? Did it, um, you know, was it something you, you were proud of, your parents were proud of? Uh, what about the relationship you have with your friends? Um, what about attendance? Just being here and being on time. You know, in each of those areas, we can always think about and reflect on what we've done and how we've done and we can find ways that we can do better in the future. So when you guys are setting goals, I want you to think about specific things. Uh, if you've got three Bs and a C this semester, uh, maybe two As and two Bs next semester. We'll get specific goals. Um, and I want you guys to set your mind to it. We have a lot of really talented, really smart kids walking in these halls that can achieve great things, but part of it is getting you know, your mind on what you want to do. So a few great things coming up. Um, I'm excited for boys basketball season this year. 7th grade, 8th grade boys are going to suit up. Um, their first game is soon. Um, we've got a February 14th celebration coming up for kiddos that are doing what they need to do uh, here at SMART. They're passing all their classes. Uh, there's a first responder call and uh, referral component to it if you're not getting those first responder calls and, and uh, referrals. Uh, that's part of being invited to that, so hopefully you guys are doing what you need to do uh, to be a part of those great celebrations that we're having. Uh, some students are going to change classes, which means you guys will get uh, different schedules coming up, so your days will look a little different. Uh, you may have a teacher you never had before. Uh, it's a great opportunity to focus on building a good relationship um, with that adult as well. Um, we got a family event coming up, I believe it's on January 23rd. I just read an email about um, games, like board games and stuff being used. So that should be a pretty cool thing if you guys are interested in those family events. And uh, there's going to be some changes to the tardy policy coming up. I can't be too specific, um, but I know that students that get multiple tardies in one day, uh, there, there'll be something the next day that they'll have to take care of. And again, it's not, we're not trying to punish people, but we do want to incentivize kids uh, to be in class on time a lot. All right, so that was a whole bunch of stuff that I just threw at you. Um, I am so proud to be here at SMART. I'm so proud of these kids walking the halls and the, and the staff members uh, working in the classrooms, the cafeterias. Um, we've got a wonderful, wonderful situation going. We're halfway through the year, uh, which we need, means we need to focus on using that second half to make this as great of an experience as we can for all of us. Thanks, everybody. Got it out.